It's hard to get up this morning. You had a little bout at what, four o'clock, Becky? How'd you guys sleep? It wasn't that bad. Like babies, terrible. <laughs> <laughs> he actually did really, I feel like he's getting better at it. He's like, he had some gas. We had to change his yeah. diaper and clothes, which is never fun in the middle of the night. But um, he's doing better, I feel like. He's like, I don't know, he's just so cute. You guys, you guys he, slept, he slept good for a baby. He did. He could not sleep good, and I would still think he's just so cute. Yeah. I can't stop looking at him. Yeah. I slept through most of it, to her credit. I did wake up at the four o'clock. Yeah, that was when he was And asking. offered to help, but you well, won't you ever give him diaper. to me. Why don't you ever give him to me? You did change his diaper. I want a turn with him in the night. You did, I did give him to you at one point. I know, but I like to be alone. I did. I, I like to take him out in the living room. Ah. Oh yeah, that's true, I remember that now. <laughs> that must have been another time. Well, if. Or was that at four? Well, I guess, do you want to really wake up in the middle of the night when he's sleeping and take him into the living room? It seemed like he was gassy and not sleeping. Well, all I did was just burp him and he fell asleep again. Look what I got. I was able to get him for a minute because, Mama had to go to the bathroom. I'm going to hold him all to myself. <laughs> Definitely looking to nurse. I'm not it, buddy. I'm sorry to disappoint. With a little baby like this, it's, um... If you're not the mama, you have to take advantage of these little tiny windows that he's kind of happy without the mama. <laughs> she's already getting a hair fussy and it hasn't even been six minutes. Hey look, look Henry, big brothers. Going to do the little animals. Good for them. In the past, that would somehow have to be me because all our kids were so little. I guess it would just happen even later because I can't hold the baby and mom go to the bathroom and do the chores all at the same time. Checked your diaper, it's good. Now we've swaddled him and that's already made him happier. Do you know how to swaddle yet? Uh, okay. like that? Well, that's sway, but look, we swaddle him and we wrap this blanket around him and he's already so much happier. Look, look how he's going at his mouth. Let's see if he wants to suck. None of our kids really took a pacifier, but maybe this one will. Oh, he got his arms. <laughs> he likes his arms up there. Okay, try this. Now, remember I taught you the five S's yesterday. So there's sway, shake, and shh. Sh We've learned to do them all at once. But there's one more. I invented it yesterday. You wanna see one more S? Yeah. One more S, there's a sixth S. Strive. <laughs> Good morning, Mr. Brown. Good morning. No matter what we do, we always lose. To mom. And we have to give him up <laughs> to mom. And that's the magic juice. Teddy, are you having the hardest time? Yes. With the adjustment. Awesome. What is all this excitement over this bundle? He's like, he does even less than me. What's the excitement? <laughs> okay, we got a little bouncy seat for him. Maybe I can still go do chores. It's okay, I'll just put it in the bathroom and I'll just take him in there. All right, I think I got it cleared. She can get out of the tub, dry off, get in the shower. Hopefully he stays. Well, that's not what I mean. Hopefully he stays there without trying waking up. We've been doing this system that works really nice where a child helps mama in the morning while we do chores, but Lily is unavailable. She's in a homeschool lesson right now online, a tutoring, so there's gonna be this hour. I think he's gonna stay? I think he's gonna stay, Becky. I think you knocked him out. All this white noise in here too. Yeah. Hey, what you doing? Hi. You mountain boarding? Uh-huh. How's it going down here? We're done. What's that ladder doing? That was just as way over. Right. Stinks so bad now. You got this one seat. Yeah. It's got the stinky milk. 
Gideon, what happened? You were with me. I don't, I know, I know. I didn't want to be out there. It's cold. Now Josiah is on his tutoring. Oh good, you're in here to help. Yeah, I'm just waiting for mom to help. Okay. Get, like the whole baby or something. Look. He's still asleep. That's a good boy. Keep him mama in rest. Tell me I'm little, see? Your eggs, darling. Thank you. All right, we've got our job cut out for us today. You know, it's a small job, it's winter, we've got a new baby, but we want to do something. It's that 1% change every day, making some kind of progress, ever, no matter how small, we're making progress. Yesterday, we forgot our legs. Oh. We pulled our blocks out and our coop just totally collapsed. That's, that's what we want to build right there. Like this? Yep. So let's just measure those two lengths. Measure the vertical one. I think it's a good... It's a 13. 17. 17. All right. 13. This is a good design right here. We had the legs shorter than the wheel and that's so it slopes a little bit. So there's not as much of a chance as a teeter-totter. So we're going to keep it that way. The height with the wheels there is a slightly lower because we did mount it into our frame as, as opposed to below our frame. So yeah, 13 would go way down. So Josiah, could you take the, the two by fours off? Thank you, Josiah. Okay, that might get you where you want to, you want to go. So it's going to come to right there. It's still slightly sloping down this yeah, way, which is better. good. Because yeah. you don't want it to topple. Yeah. Hopefully we didn't do our handle too close to the front. So it's a V forming at the bottom. See on this one we have our handle quite as far way back. I know we're gonna have to do this. See this here? Yeah, that'll work. Yep. It comes up here and we go ahead and screw it in. Hey, good job painting that. Uh, Josiah, Arun, I ended up having to step away. We've got a painter here with not enough work to fill a day. So we're like, hey, could you paint the the wrestling ring? It's got this cable like this, but I guarantee you, Arun has a suspicion the boys have done something with it. It's probably, it's probably the zip line now. <laughs> Who knows? We just got all the plastic off of it. Two good tires, one horrible tire. Hopefully we have enough. One dead tire, another dead one. So all three wheels in the back are hopefully some somewhat useful. Hopefully we can drag this thing, this spot. What's going on? Maybe. Trying to make this uh, hook work. I'm trying to open that so we can put that on our cord. Yeah. All right, he's got it. Jonah. Oh my word, it's hard to keep him on track. Jonah, you come drive, Arun and I are gonna push. Josiah, you might watch and make sure we're not hanging up somewhere. <laughs> All right guys, get down. The plan is Jonah will drive this, Arun and I will push it. What happened? Our little hook bust? No, it didn't bust because the... Yeah, look, it oh, unwrapped. Yes. Tie the cable, yeah, there you go. Wait, it needs to be lower too, I think, to offer more support. We got it tied on there. We're not holding up too good up back here, but somehow it seems to be moving. Because we're rolling on the rims. Yeah, it's just dragging it. Seems to be okay, it's not dragging the frame. The angle seems to be holding it. Whoa! All right, there we go. Now you can get it going straight. You think this is fine, Arun? I think it's a, a miracle we got over here, huh? Look at this. All three back wheels are destroyed. I think because we had air in this one, Summit, in these, we were okay. Oh no, my God. Because so, the front one is okay, and that's why yeah, we want to bring otherwise. I think so. The problem is this is just gonna rust away if we don't paint it. The painter was kind enough to say, hey, do you have any other work for me? Because you know, there's a minimum work payment for, for making the effort to come out. And this is gonna be a great opportunity for that. So I'm so appreciative of that. Oh look, we got one bending. 
They just have yeah. it. We'll have to put a brace on it like this one. Yeah. Oh! Little man waking up. He is. He's very happy. Are you very happy? <laughs> Are you very happy? Are you going to smile? We're going to catch your first smile on camera. Oh, oh he didn't like that. This made him sad. <laughs> he thinks it's a nursing. You want a nurse? That's all I want, Mom. Forget the kisses. He's like, oh. his blinking is like so deliberate. He's like, it's been a lot of work. Yeah, like, oh, look, he's smiling. Where's that gas? Is that a smile? <laughs> Is that a smile? Are you seeing the fuzzy thing on top of the camera? Are you seeing that? Or is that gas? What or do you think, Mom? you see Mommy. Oh, look. And you just love me so we'll much. We'll take it as a smile. You just love me so much. I get to hold you. We just ate breakfast. My mom is here. Are you getting upset? Look at you. You've grown in a week. <laughs> See, I have. It's my job. That's what we want to hear. So beautiful. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Washed <laughs> <laughs> up, oh. Oh, no, he, oh, you won't do that. With he you. does that with anything that's not his mama. Rebecca nursed him. Now my mom gets to hold him. He's happy now. <laughs> oh, he's licking it, <laughs> Papa. He likes that hand up there. Oh. Looky here, he's painted it. This looks so good. I mean, as good as a mobile sheep pen can look. Totally stop this thing from rusting, I hope. At least give us some more time. Look a hair better out in the pasture. This looks good. We had debated whether or not to paint the panels. I'm kind of glad we did, didn't. It looks good. Black frame and panels i mean we're not looking for a uh a perfect paint job here so that just did the that did the trick looks so good for those of you that are new to the show that is our mobile sheep pen for our uh, ram male sheep when it's not breeding season we keep him and a buddy which happens to be a castrated male out in the pasture moving them around on grass during the growing season and separated from everybody. How's it going, Becky? It's going good. You're laying down? Yeah. My uh, pelvis is hurting back here, so I needed to just lay down and take pressure off of it. You are a resting champion. Take care of yourself. Midwife instructed a two-week rest. Yeah, she but, wanted me to um, do another week in bed. I'm sure you'll be excited to get back at it. Taking care of some business, approving the vlog, getting a TikTok going. I do have something exciting to share with you guys here. Been working on the storyboard with my co-director of Rooted. This next episode is gonna be very, very, very special. We'll actually be doing some batch filming for two episodes over like four days. But this next episode is gonna be about, and it's about time. Because, Rebecca, you, what you did, man, you're really a hero. <laughs> and there's a lot of women out there that can relate to you. There was, inspired there was no options. <laughs> <laughs> That's just, I mean, there was no option of not doing it. So. <laughs> so I posted this picture on Instagram of Rebecca and said a little something nicer. You guys can go see it at the Justin Rhodes Show. A lot of people resonate with that. And she's inspiring a lot of people. So this next show, it, it's not just going to be about her, but it's going to be about the the goodness that is motherhood. So it's gonna be about all you mothers, wouldn't you say, Rebecca? Mm -hmm. Cause you definitely don't like being the center of attention. No. This is gonna drive you nuts. It is. But you're doing it for the ladies, aren't you? For the ladies. <laughs> <laughs> it's for the ladies. Oh, for the ladies, not for me. Parenting and mama and, and, and the courage that it takes to be a good mom. That's gonna be a good show. <laughs> she, yeah, your name. Bless her. She's so humble. I don't. I don't so like being humble. the center of attention. So humble. When Justin and I got married, it would cause me so much anxiety yeah. to, because I was like, oh, everybody's gonna be looking at us, like at me. Oh, this so it was so hard. We should oh. have just eloped. Look at that little. It's so cute. It's so cute. It's oh, so cute. She, you wanted me to get him socks. I did want to get socks because he keeps putting it out. Tiny. Makes me nervous. Do you think it's gonna get cold? I do. It is gonna get cold. Do we have socks over here? I think they're in here. 
He's not even a week old, and I'm already hunting his socks. Henry, where are your shoes? Is it going to be Henry, where are your socks? Do you want to put them on? Or I hope it's to? not going to be. I hope it's going to be Henry. You just know where everything is. <laughs> He's so organized. <laughs> you You're back. the most organized two year old I know. <laughs> She's swimming in those tiny socks. I know. He's getting there though. He's gaining weight. He is. Oh, I should like get weigh myself boy. and then weigh him. You gonna oh, weigh? I don't, I don't care. You gonna tell us? You I'm don't not, care? I'm not one of those people. This is the lady who knows I'm gonna be Big Papa. And she don't. What if they call you Big Mama? It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> you go. You go with it. 153 pounds. Are you happy about that or upset? I'm trying to think how much I weighed at the end. So I lost like. 13 pounds, I guess. That's a wrap. If you want a sample of our new show, Rooted, go to uh, watchrooted.com or link down in the description and you'll be on our email list and you'll know when the next episode comes out and you'll get a chance to get in there. If you're not in our member area, we'll get you in there. Where'd you go? I'm gonna go, you take a nap. Come on, you can take a nap. Just a little nap. a nap. Just a little tiny nap. Five minutes. You're fine. Just five minutes. You probably won't sleep more than that anyway. The woman fights a nap as hard as a three-year-old. Ah, uh, but hopefully she'll take a little cat nap. I'll take Teddy on a walk. We'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs>